Hey guys. Happy one o'clock. You ready for pies? Oh baby. It's always so much fun. My favorite time of the year. Trying to figure out how to order and distribute over a thousand pies. Yay. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. <laughs> All right. So let's uh, dive right in because <clears throat> we have uh, a bunch to cover and I know everyone's busy. So um, I'll give you a little bit of background. Uh, we've been doing uh, a lot of um, agents have been doing pie giveaways for a really long time, right? Giving pies to past clients or pies to database or pies to people who bought from you the previous 12 months, whatever, whatever the, the idea is, um, it's, not, it's not a new one, right, for, uh, for real estate agents. The two years ago, what was new and unique was we decided to uh, kind of take, uh, take this at the market center level and create a program that allowed you to leverage us so that more of you could uh, plug in and and take advantage of the uh, of the, the pie giveaway and not have to worry so much about the operations side of it so um, uh, so that's kind of what we're looking to repeat again for the third time now this year last year was a little a little different because drive through um, we do not have to necessarily do a drive through this year and so uh, here's the here's the outline um, goodness we'll keep popping into the waiting room so let me just clear that out all right <clears throat> so here's the outline um the program is going to be run very similarly to the um, sign in to win program from the last couple of weeks we will have uh, a schedule for you it will begin this wednesday so 48 hours from now right this wednesday and they'll they'll be just uh, I think three touches is the is the idea because it's a much shorter time period. It's a much shorter program. Um, those three touches will be uh, email and uh, and text and phone uh, is what we're going to encourage you to do. If you want to do a social media post, um, you can certainly do that. However, remember, um, social media posts go to a wider group of people and you, you're you're paying for the pies. So the, the idea of, of perhaps keeping it to, uh, to your database or to past clients or people who bought from you this year, what, again, whatever your path is, um, might, be, uh, might be wise. And so uh, we'll start this Wednesday. All pie orders, and I'll explain how it's going to work in a second. All pie orders need to be in by Monday, November the 15th. So again, it's a it's a it's a little less than two weeks period of, of time that you can um, create opportunities to discuss and convert, converse with your database and reward them with a, a gratitude Thanksgiving pie. So Monday, November fifteenth at twelve noon is the uh, is the deadline for orders. Uh, what we're doing slightly differently than the last two years this year is we're going to use the same concept as the sign in to win. Now, again, you guys get to make a choice as to whether or not you want to drive your clients, your database to the Google sheet that they will just simply sign in on, right? What is my agent's name? What is my name? Um, do I want, what, what kind of pie do I want, right? And maybe some little question about, uh, about real estate or you know, some statement about how thankful we are for them or, or whatnot. So something simple. You get to decide whether or not your collateral material drives your folks directly to that and they go and do it themselves. Or if you wanna take control of that, right? Some of you have done this in the past, you've kind of taken control and you've made outbound conversation. Uh, you, you've blasted out, here's what we're doing. And then your outbound conversation took the orders. And then, uh, so if you still wanna do that, if you wanna be the recipient, the, the, um, the receptacle, if you will, of the orders for your people, then you can, um, you can then go on to the, the portal and pop in what you need, right? So your, your choice, you don't have to drive people to the portal if you don't want to, uh, but it is, it is additional leverage for you and uh, we, we encourage it. Um, uh, pies, the pies are either pumpkin or apple. 
They are the Costco pumpkin and the Costco apple. If you've ever had Costco pumpkin pie and, or Costco uh, apple pie, you know that they're huge, like manhole size cover um, uh, pies, and they're delicious, right? So, uh, so that's those are the pies that we will uh, we'll be getting. We will create and distribute the collateral material for you, uh, like we did with the sign-in to win. So you'll you'll have the same kind of um, kind of rollout where collateral materials will be uh, emailed out to you. Uh, any customizations that you're looking for uh, with name and, and telephone number will be done uh, on, on your behalf and then posted to a Google Drive. Uh, as a matter of fact, we're just going to use the same Google Drives as the sign in to win. So you can just keep the same links um, and the same access to your, um, to your personal stuff. Um, instead of having it just be sign in to win, any, any kind of programs that we do from now on, you'll just have your, uh, your link and your spot on um, in the cloud. The collateral materials will include either PDF, uh, PDF and or JPEG slash PNG forms of uh, something like an invite or a, you know, thanks so much for, for being you, have a pie on us type thing um, that you can drop into an email. You can also use that. Um, if you wanna do a postcard, you can certainly turn it into a postcard. Um, and then we'll give you text for, uh, for both the email as well as uh, a text uh, outbound text to remind people to go ahead and, and do that, and then scripts for uh, for calls to the folks that you want to make calls to. And again, there'll be a calendar just like sign in to win to say, hey, do this on this day. Again, it's all tight. It's all a much it's a compressed time frame because we have uh, we have to get orders in because this time, unlike last time, we actually have to have people <laughs> bake, right? Um, and so I, I think. I think who we're down to is I think Alice and Lori um, were, were had volunteered. I think Alice is going to do the pumpkin pies and Lori's going to do the apple pies. Right, ladies, you're, you're going to be the bakers. <laughs> all right, all right, just just looking for a reaction. So, um, so of course Costco is going to be doing all the baking. Um, kidding, and then of course our program also includes a um, a whip us up a referral between now and, and pie pickup day and receive a free can of whipped cream for your pie incentive that will be on your materials. So, um, and, and likely part of, the, part of the portal as well. So what we noticed is that in the past, when we just gave away pies, that was lovely. When we actually gave people an incentive to give us a name or a referral to get an extra, to get the, the can of whipped cream, you'll be surprised how many people will work hard to get that extra can of free $1.79 whipped cream, right? And I know it sounds crazy, and yet we're, we're not going backwards on it because it, it works. So that'll be part of, that, uh, part of that program. And then of course, we'll also have uh, customized labels for you to put on top of the pie um, for you to give out so people know it's from you. Um, the uh, pie pickup day, for the clients or for you if you choose to deliver them, uh, right? Because you can have them come to our locations for pickup and or you can just pick them up from a location and then go and do pie deliveries. There are some of you who prefer that over having them come to you. Uh, you, you and you get to make that choice. However, pie pickup day uh, from our, our locations is Monday, November 22nd. So that is the Monday prior to Thanksgiving, uh, times from one till five. So pickup day is Monday the 22nd from one until 5 p.m. Um, we do need the morning to orchestrate the, uh, the pickup and, uh, and getting everything set for people to start arriving. So that is why the afternoon time is uh, what we're going to be advertising. Now the cost, the cost of the program is nothing except for the cost of your pies, right? We're gonna handle everything, including the, the, the trucks and whatnot to, and the personnel to get to pick up the pies and deliver the pies um, to our locations. So right now, what I can tell you is pies will be delivered to both market center locations, 404 Main Street in Ridgefield and 2777 uh, Summer Street in Stamford. We are working to make arrangements to have pies if they need to be delivered to, uh, to Westport, Newtown, or Danbury to make things simpler. We are working on a, on a, on a way to make that happen as well. Um, so minimally, 
Um, I know every, everybody, everybody wants one that's closest to them. I get it. And yet, right, but the, the idea of, of uh, market center based um, delivery, and then we're working on, um, I just I want to make you a promise that we, we end up not be able, being able to keep. So um, don't, don't not participate because you think that we won't be able to swing the delivery. I think we'll, we'll be fine, but until we, have the, um, until we have the trucking company and the personnel to actually do it and confirmed, we will, um, we will state that um, the two market center locations and we're working on the, the, the three others to get them there as well knowing that it's, it's far more convenient. And a lot of you in the past have used other locations as your pie pickup spot, right? So, so knowing that you're going to have kind of your own deal going on in, in another location, um, we wanna make that as simple as possible for you. The cost of the pies, depending on whether you do uh, pumpkin or apple, apple is eight bucks per and, uh, sorry, pumpkin is $8 per and apple is $12 per. Same prices as last year. That is inclusive of your pie, of the delivery of your pie, of all the collateral materials, and of any whipped creams that your folks uh, earn by, uh, by delivering you uh, referrals prior to pickup day or even at pickup day. Um, you get to decide whether or not you're offering pumpkin or apple or both. Um, I will tell you the, the portal's going to have a, a choice for, for pumpkin or apple. And so if your choice is to only do one, which, which is completely fine, you may, have to, you may have to decide to take all the orders yourself and then put them into the portal if you, if you don't want. Um, and if, if you're only doing one, your, your material is gonna have to be a little, uh, a little different. So that'll be the information that we, uh, that we gather from you. Um, I can tell you that we've done it both ways. We, we've done it, um, um, only pumpkin in the past, and that has worked really well. And last year we added apple to the mix, and that worked really well. So um, it's it's all about it's all about offering people some some free pie, right? Don't get don't, don't get too hung up on on any further details. Okay, um, if you decide you want to participate in this program, just like the last program, we're going to ask you to email newkwlistings at gmail.com. Stephen, can you please put that in the chat? newkwlistings at gmail.com and just have the, uh, have the subject be you know, yes to pies and we will then be in touch with you in the next 24 hours or so to clarify exactly what it is um, you're looking for your pie experience to be. Uh, if you choose to do personal delivery of your pies, again, they'll still go to a, a, an office location that you indicate, and then we will, you'll come and pick up the pies from there and then do your own, uh, own delivery. Um, somebody two years ago asked if we could drop them at their house. The answer to that is no. Um, I, I appreciate the ask, but no, um, you got to yeah, at least come to, to, a, to an office location. Um, and then, of course, on pie pickup day, we'll have you know we'll have a little something um, um, at the at the locations, so that if you want to have your folks come in and uh, pick them up, and we'll have some cider and donuts or whatnot in case you want to hang out and just have a little chat with your with your your folks, we'll give them a reason to hang out and and uh, and whatnot. So that's kind of the extent of the of the pie program. For those of you who have done it before, you know how well it would. Um, um, how well it works, and you know, you know the business that you guys get from it, which is why you keep coming back and doing it each year. So, um, any questions that anybody has now would be the time. Let me go to the chat and see what is in the chat. Um, refri refrigeration, no, we that's why we picked them up that morning, and then they hang out in the market center. Um, that that day until the afternoon. They do not need to stay refrigerated um, for that, that period of time. They should then take them home and put them in the refrigerator. But if we had to worry about refrigeration, there's no way we could do this. So um, please remember too that your, um, your pie orders, your pie orders 
are your pie orders and you'll get billed back for the pie orders that are attached to your name, right? If nobody comes and picks up your pies and you have 20 pies for your family for Thanksgiving, um, invite some more people to Thanksgiving, right? We, we can't be responsible for the pickup. So it, it, we're, we're responsible for getting you the pies that you ordered. And then once they are, um, here's the other thing that, that we struggle with, right? Sometimes people don't come and pick up the pies and then agents don't take their pies home with them that night. And then we struggle trying to find refrigeration inside of our locations. And again, it, the, there's enough of you now that, um, that that's going to become a bigger and bigger issue. So just, just plan on whatever doesn't get uh, picked up that you need to just have some, some room at home to, um, to handle that and then go and deliver those uh, the next day or so. What questions do we have? I have a question. Yes. Um, okay, if their pies get only delivered to Ridgefield or Stanford and your folks that order them don't live near Ridgefield or Stanford, is it okay to just pick some other, what, what do you think would be a more central location for the people you know to come pick up from? Yeah, no, no. So so again, we're, we're working on, so please remember this, this, is not, this is not personal delivery of pies. This is, this is us doing the, the, the tail end work to make this more accessible to more of you. If that means that you then have to go to one of those locations and pick up the pies and bring them back to a different location, that may be what that means. We are working right now to correct that and have available drop-offs at all five of our locations if, that, if that's necessary. So, so don't, don't, don't plan on it being an issue. We're, we're working on that. I just wanted to be upfront about the fact that, that in the past, it's only been the two locations. And then here's the thing, P people, people will travel for pie. If you think that's untrue, ask some of your colleagues who are on this call. They drive, they drive from 30 or 40 minutes away to pick up their pie. So, so don't convince yourself that if they have to drive out of their way a little bit and it's not convenient five minutes down the street that somehow the program doesn't, isn't worthwhile for you. Yeah, no, I was meant that like, if, if I want to, no, I meant I would pick up all the pies to people I have that order, but I can have them someplace more convenient for them to pick up them either Stanford or Ridgefield. That was what yeah, I was. Yeah, ab absolutely. If you, we you can't can, get it to the other offices. Yeah, you can, you can do, once you pick up your pies, you can, you can choose to do whatever it is you'd like with, uh, with those with those pies. You could have like a tailgate in the parking lot with pie. You could, right? So a whole lot of different, uh, different ideas. Or again, delivery is another uh, option. What else? What are the questions? Uh, anything else in the chat? Uh, the pies are from Costco. Uh, you don't order the whipped cream. We'll just have we'll just make sure we have enough. Um, we we pretty much know what the what the ratio is. If, if we're ordering a thousand pies, we'll we'll have we'll have plenty of whipped cream. Um, so no worries on that. What else? Anything else? Uh, when do we have to say yes by? Uh, well, we're going to start on Wednesday. So I, I would so I would encourage saying yes by Wednesday because because if you want some customizations to the thing, to, to the to the um, to the graphic, um, we need to know ASAP, right? So I, I would say tonight into tomorrow to give us at least twenty four hours to to customize your stuff, um, and then uh, and then if if you if you tune in a little bit later. That's okay too. We had a bunch of people tune in a little bit later for the sign in to win, and they uh, they just kind of made up the, the time. So, but the quick answer, Alice, is is um, next twenty four to forty eight hours would be very helpful. Um, the deadline to order the pies is um, so yeah. The deadline to order is Monday the fifteenth, and pie pickup is the twenty second. Um, what is the bakery manager at Costco giving you for Christmas this year? <laughs> yeah. Um, and of course, we, we, we spread the wealth, right? Because so it's Norwalk Costco and Brookfield Costco. We do a, a Southern order and a Northern order. And um, I'm always amazed when, when we go to them with these massive orders. I think last year we had, uh, between the two, we had over 800 um, or 850 pies or something like that. And they, they just take it in stride. They're like, okay, we'll have them ready. 
like really don't, like not even a holy cow or a wow <laughs> but they must get a lot of these uh, these orders so they have their little pie elves doing their 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 fancy stuff any other questions yes Karen. i do sorry i'm driving and i can't be texting but um so when do we pay for the pies we pay up pick up on that day or do we pay on the 15 on that line like when when the order is complete yeah great it's great my question. first year so i haven't done this before yeah so so um so we'll we'll simply invoice you back at some point um at some point post or ordering um exactly okay. when I, I i can't tell you so sometime between the 15th and the end of the month we'll just invoice you uh invoice you back the good news okay. is that we, we know where each of you live so we're not we're not too we're not afraid of of uh of ordering those pies. Yeah. <laughs> okay thank you yeah. you're welcome what else That's it. All right, well, that was simple. So um, please note, if, if you have any questions or whatnot um, and you want to be put in touch with someone who's done this in the past, just, just let me know and we'll be happy to connect you with, uh, with folks who have done this previously and they'll give you the good, the bad, and the in-between on it. The, um, it it's, a, it's a great program. And you know this one, this one costs you a little more than the, than the last one, but it, it's, it's really, uh, a great way to say thank you to your folks. Uh, people, you cannot believe how appreciative people um, are and will be with uh, with thank you pies. So have a great, great experience. We'll, um, we'll look to make it as simple as possible for you. And um, we'll look forward to hearing your yeses. Hey, Rick. Yes, it's, it's one It's one pie per sign in, right? People don't order more than one. Yes. So, well, th so that's, that, that's up, that's up to you. I, I would, I would encourage you to, to gift one pie per person, right? That they shouldn't be doing their Thanksgiving um, shopping with, with your, with your gratitude, right? It's just, it's a matter of you saying thank you and, and uh, offering them a pie. So the, the, when they pick apple or pumpkin on the portal, or if you pick apple or pumpkin on the portal, it will be in either, or they won't be able to put in both and they won't be able to say, please give me six, right? Great, thank you. You're welcome. All right, guys, I hope this was helpful. Uh, any other questions, don't hesitate to reach out. I'm gonna push out the email uh, before dinner tonight. And Fiona, yes. Thank you, Rick. You're welcome. Have a great one, guys. I'll, I'll push you this out too, before bye. dinner. Cheers.